and fire officials calling this a gas explosion that happened around 3:30 this afternoon. Just take a look at me. Take a look at the scene right now. You can see the home is blocked off. You can see people who were inside are now standing outside. And if we can just show you where it all happened, fire officials telling us that when they arrived here, there were people screaming from the windows and the balconies for help. And that's when firefighters jumped into action, trying to get everyone out. And if Xavier, can we just show them this door here? I want to show you the impact of this gas explosion. That is actually a door from this home that actually blew out and is now entangled with those electrical wires that you see. Again, we're told this happened around 3.30 this afternoon at this multifamily home, 1520 Polding Avenue here in the Bronx. We talked with one man who said he heard people screaming and he ran to help. He climbed up that ladder and he held the child to safety. Two other people we talked with say they were inside. They smelled the gas. They heard an explosion and saw things flying all over the place. Right now, we're told two people are critical, including an adult and child. Take a listen to those people who were inside. Uh, I heard the lady screaming, to, you know, because she had the baby right there. So I run to it and I grabbed the baby. And how, how old was the baby? Was it like kind of a uh, four, six months? The room was just upside down in about a second. That's what I keep telling people because that's what it felt like. I'm texting on my phone. I look up. The room is literally different. And we're told that there were several people, again, who were injured, at least nine, eight people, one firefighter. The youngest, a child around three years old with special needs. Again, the cause of this gas explosion still unknown at this time. But again, you can see a lot of fire officials here, Con Edison, all trying to figure out exactly what 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 went wrong here today. Again, there are nine injuries in total. Two people were told are critical. Those two people, an adult and then a child. We are live in the Bronx. Jennifer Bisram, Pix 11 News.